Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Fallout 76. Where we last left off, we were hanging out in the wastes. What are you doing? I'm just hanging out in the wastes. Still, all this time. <laughs> all this time I've been too. doing nothing else. Me Yay. too. You know so, what? Uh, I really like the idea. This or, town. I really like the looks of this structure that almost looks like a satellite dish pointed straight up. You see it up there? On the hill? Yeah. That one? Yep, that one right there. That looks cool. Yeah. I remember I went, and I don't remember exactly where it was, but it was this place called the CN Tower. I want to say it was in Cincinnati uh, on a road trip when I was younger. And it was really cool. It was this incredibly tall building, like ridiculously tall. And it had, um, it had a glass floor. Oh, that's cool. At the very top. Uh, well, I mean, my fat ass would be scared of a glass floor. I was seven or eight, and I was a chunky little boy, that's for sure. And, um, yeah, I was. I was terrified. It didn't, like, dawn on me that, well, there's no way they would put this here if it was any kind of dangerous. Yeah. It was just like, oh my god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna fall through, and I'm gonna have minutes to think about that I am going to die when I hit the ground. <laughs> It was a yeah. terrifying aspect. Looking back on it, I'm glad I went and got out on there because it was really cool. But it was also really, really scary. Hey, Mitcher. Yo. Um, what do you want to do quest-wise so that we have something to sort of head towards? Eh. Uh... Find the next journal, or just explore this town. This fire truck is cool. Look at this thing. This is like an APC fire truck. That is cool. Maybe this gun launches coconuts. What do you think? Coconut you know launcher. What? If it doesn't, I think it was a massive oversight on the designer's part. Agreed. Yeah, it shoots water. Also shoots coconuts through a concrete slab. Sneak attack for 2x damage. Sneak attack for 2x damage. What was that? One of these stupid things popped, I thought. It had the same sound. Got him. Oh god, here's uh, another person with 400 different items on him. Oh, there's another one. Yeah, bullets. Okay, if bullets strike those corpses, they um, pop. So God, I'm right already here. over encumbered again. Are you watching this? Yep. So that's what we heard. I One of the see. stray bullets hit that thing. Well, I'm over encumbered again. I have never found that's anything when theme. searching one of them. Have you? No, it just explodes and gives me rads. Yeah, which means we need to not do it because we just invested, like, between episodes, we just, like, dumped a bunch of crap in getting our rads gone. Yeah. And I've already got some back. Oh, uh, toothbrush. Definitely want that in the wastes. You know, I buy that. It's Girl, like let me holla at that toothbrush. That toothbrush. Sometimes I just get in the uh, mood to brush my teeth. Like, if I, like... Oh, God. Sometimes I just have to brush my teeth. Like, the idea will come to my mind, and I just have to do it. What is a rack? Mm. I'm all taken. Mm. We talking slang? Like, female no, girl. breasts? <laughs> I mean, if it ain't a female thing. You got a rack, son. I'm gonna get a suckle <laughs> on them. He ain't kidding. I'm rocking some, uh... It's me, rack you less, if you will. I see what you did there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, I'm I'm all about going for the next um, journal. That would be the Morganton High School. The problem is, is I still haven't figured out the waypoint system. I don't know how to tell which one of these stupid waypoints is that. You know what I mean? Without like going to the map. Yeah. Like, am I? That's the inoculation project. All right, direct due east. See the door? It's due east. It's like a loading door. Yeah. That's the high school. You want to head that way? Show. Sure. Uh, where is the stairs? Where is the stairs? Did they come up inside yet? 
I'm going to say, I've gone all the way around this thing. Where are them stairs? I found an iBot. For steel scrap? And Yeah. And a yeah, Protectatron. Oh, there's a I bunch didn't... of robots in here. This is the robot repair shop. Apparently. Fallout Geek Squad. <laughs> Need to update your RAM on your new... Um, what, I bought? Yeah. Can I clear this wall here? Yup. You find anything useful or interesting over there? No, I'm just scrapping a whole bunch of stuff, so hopefully I can walk around. Yay, I can walk around now. There's a cool tank over here. Where you at? Where you at? I found you. I'm coming. There's a dead person hey, in do, a wheel. Do I show up on your map when I'm crouching? Probably. Yes. Bad dudes. I see you, bad dudes. I don't know who you think you're fooling. God, everybody mm. drops a gun. And it's like, I want to pick up the gun so I can, like, um,. So I can dismantle them, so I can upgrade my current guns, but then I just you, can't you, move. <laughs> yep. Yep, same thing over here in Paisano. And what I used to do is I would like, okay, I've dumped 10 hours into this Fallout 3 playthrough. I've already got the guns I want, and it's just a matter of maintaining them. So it's like, oh, that can be applied to the gun that I'm carrying. So, you know what I mean? Yeah. Add it, do it, fix it, keep it upgraded, keep it working good i Do don't it. like Pump it. i don't like the Twist way this it. works it seems like you would basically need to stop if you want to pick up a lot of stuff and keep your character going you'll basically need to stop like every 10 minutes and break everything down yeah which is just artificial time inflation yeah a friend of ours, Dear Denizens, was just telling me an hour ago that he's already seeing max level characters just hanging out at Vault 76. Just nothing to do. The game's been out two days. Alright, I'm going to clear the wall right here. Go through the water, even though that's probably a bad idea because rads. Alright, I just discovered Morganton. Me too. We're in danger. Something is aware of our location. It's probably these feral ghouls up here. I don't see them. Straight ahead. He's laying down. He's a sneaky boy. You want to stealth on. him? I'll stand by while you do it. I have a 0% chance of a headshot. Got him. Ah, spoopy boy. Got him. That was actually a really cool fight for some reason. The way they like animated ran towards us. It was different yeah, than this spooky. I, I don't really like the way those um scorched things just kind of stand there. Yeah, they're basically just you know, regular bad guys. I do like the way the feral ghouls just come, like, pouring at you. Yeah. Got him. Discovered Morganton High School. Mm, it says we're supposed to go in there for something. Yeah, that's where we're getting the next journal. Ah. It's the high school of um, the overseer that we're, like, Following in her footsteps. Ha <laughs> following in the footsteps. You get it? You get it? Fallout reference! <laughs> okay. Our illustrious overseer that we've never actually met. Just get wrecked. I said get wrecked. Nice. 
Well, let's just go in. I mean, it's right over here. Might as well. Because, I mean, these people are just going to keep spawning out here indefinitely. Yeah, that's also we'll something keep... I'm not super fond of in this, is it's like, oh, you cleared an area? Well, guess what? No, you didn't. <laughs> it at least should be like a day-night cycle. You know what I mean? Like, when we come out of this high school, there's going to be a bunch of, like, feral ghouls out there. Like, no doubt. Yeah. At the end of the day, this is everything that I don't like about MMOs. You're the hero. So is everyone else. Do this quest that's important to save the world. Along with everyone else. You're our only hope. So is everyone else. Ugh, I don't want to uh, hope... listen to the overseer. Oh good, what was I didn't that... have to. What was the name of that, Mitchell? Uh, yeah, I we gotta know. listen. That's... Listen to it. Overseal's journey is uh, Personal matters. Uh, so that's items. That's hollow. Tree. Listen to Overseer's journal entry three. All right, I hear ghouls or those scorched things. Your mom died in a mining accident? What is this, like 1914? Data mining. It had to be data mining. That makes more sense. Bitcoin was all the rage. Nuka coin. <laughs> That's our new business model. Let's invent Nuka coin. We'll be billionaires. Oh god, I didn't see you. Get wrecked. He's dead. I saw him roll out of his chair. This 308 rifle is dope. I love the 308 rifle. Like, stay crouched, sneak attack for double damage. Got him. Yeah, I guess you could do that. If you're boring. I was concerned. <laughs> that I would have trouble keeping up with non-stealth players walking around crouched, but it hasn't really happened that way. No, I'm kind of I'm kind of hanging back and exploring and letting you do your thing. I don't understand what the lights how that what effect if any it has on my um, visibility, you know what I mean? I haven't yeah, really they probably didn't think that far into it. <laughs> so we have nothing to do here except go to the university, right? Like we're done here. We can go back out to Appalachia right here if you're interested. But I kind of want to yeah. see up oh, behind you. That guy was right big old, big old. Nice shot, Mitchell. I got, I, I shot him in the face. I said, nice shot, Mitchell. And I, 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 I shot him in the face. I think uh, I did there's some anyway. caps over here. Yeah, I'll take them. I think there's I a didn't get none. right over here somewhere. Oh, well. What am I? He had an axe. He wanted to ask you a question. He did. I want a bench. Me too. I am now over encumbered. So I want you need. Yeah. Coming in behind you. I wung in him. First aid, could jigger on the wall there. A who's or what, sir? Uh, Mitchell, Mitchell, Blast Radius, the board game. Take! I wanted to play. That's actually really good because it gives you nuclear material, which you need for sites, because that makes sense. Uh, that does make sense. Tritium is a radioactive... I think it's radioactive... Um, material that they actually use in sites. I'll eat crow. I've learned something today. <laughs> it did not make sense to me because I was ignorant and unlearned. What a fool I've been. You want to just head to this door, this Appalachia door over here? I just picked up a TV dinner tray, and one time I stole a TV dinner tray for <laughs> Mitchell because I love him. It wasn't stealing. It was reacquiring. That's true. What was it? Uh, 
Sonic tray? Hang on. Well, what be is careful it? what you say. They may still be on the look for us. That's true. <laughs> yeah, God it was almighty. a Sonic tray. I was like, man, I love these trays. I really want one. <laughs> Boyfriend to the rescue. Yep. Are you wearing your oven back ended headphones? Up in the car. Nope. I wonder what's changed recently where that, that kind of slapback sound has come back. Either I'm being I have louder no idea. or you listen to me louder now. Either way, I'm a narcissist, so hearing myself speak, love it. <laughs> yeah. You ready roll, Paisano? Yeah, let's get out of here. This place is tapped. Plus, you know, we got to get a head start on this like 10 minute loading screen that we're about to have to sit through. So, how was your day, Mitchell? <laughs> Well, you know, so I woke up today and I sat around for a little while and then the wife came home and she brought home dinner and I kissed her face because it's a good face. And uh, we sat, we ate dinner and we spent time with each other and then we pet petted the doggos and we watched a little TV and uh, now we're playing Fallout. Hey, hey, your turn. I, I was off today, I did nothing, hung out. Did some recording, did some uploading, did some editing, moved around some data, backed up all my stuff to my offsite drive. He means data. He's not a cretin. Pleb. <laughs> so, loading screen. It was pretty long. What was I like the fog effect in this game. I think a lot of I games mean... used to use a fog effect to like shroud, like. Um, draw distance. Nintendo and 64, like, bruh. Yeah, and you know what? I That was my era of stuff, so like, even that if there's no the reason for it to be that... foggy in a game, I like fog in a game. That was one of the reasons that Silent Hill was so scary, is because they used all that fog. The very uh, first I, Silent Hill. I hit start, and okay, there we go. I was going to say, it seems like the game crashed. Um, so just... You know, I'll, I'll give this game that. We haven't had very many crashes. It was hard to get into, and there have been a couple of weird things, but why will you not melee? Okay. Oh, I was out of action points. You want to go Fair. this way and learn about the inoculation project instead of heading straight to the next, like, main quest thing? If I can get over there. <laughs> I'm over-encumbered. Yeah, like we really need to see if we can always. find a bench. There's some back the way we came, I know that. Dude, I don't even remember which way we came from. I was hoping you did, because I don't. Well, here's the Red Rocket gas station that the sign talked about. I say we stop here. Yeah, there's probably one in there. We're not stopping at that gas station. Uh, found a nothing new... Nothing in there? No, there's nothing in there. I found a new radio station. We'll probably get some quest from it. You know, that the seems guy talking, to be we'll leave it up for a minute. one of the we'll only ways to get quests. Aha! You didn't look good enough, Caleb. What'd you find? Workbench. Where are you? Aha! Well, you know what, Mitchell? We're still not stopping at this gas station. I'm at the I moon. am. I gotta get rid of this stuff. Okay, well, I'm going to go up here and look at this house. Will you please let me know the moment you get off the bench so that we don't waste time? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Thank you, thank you. So I'm uh -huh. up here. Uh -huh. What do we got? What do we got? Mm-hmm, I hear you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, yes, proceed. Uh, toy alien, take. Done. <laughs> Done. I remember in Fallout 3, I would pick up interesting stuff like that. And it was like, uh, I'm going to put this stuff all around my house. <laughs> I did the same thing. I had cool stuff laying all over my house in Megaton. And it was like, ooh, this is a one-time use interesting quest item that I don't have to use and get to keep afterwards. By the way, I'm off the bench. Um, what? Um, I'm going to set it out in my house, and it's going to look cool. I was hoping you would stay at the bench so I would know where it is. Okay, I see it. Um, <laughs> what was the big um, super mutant that you could get as a follower? Fox. Fox lived in my house in Fallout 3 yeah. because I played stealth. So every time I would go walk into um, my house, he was just standing there like holding his massive like minigun like, yeah. to greet me home. 
Hello! It's like Jesus. Welcome home! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, he was a cool character. Yeah. And not I, I really, a super mutant party member you could get in Fallout. A little bit of Fallout lore there for you. In Fallout 2, you can get a super mutant party member named Marcus. He's super cool. Is he cooler than Fox? Uh, yeah, he's cooler than Fox, but he doesn't run around with an unlimited ammo minigun. <laughs> Does he have... I need to favorite my Vault 76 jumpsuit before I accidentally scrap it. Do Does he have a cool um, voice? Is he voice acted? Yes, I'm actually looking up the name of the voice actor right now because I always forget it. Okay, what is this? A weapons? This is armor. I can do a true um, long barrel now. That's pretty cool. Wonder glue. Uh, let's go back to item. That's it. I always forget his name. It's uh, Michael Dorn. I believe he also played uh, Worf in Star Trek The Next Generation. How do I? Oh, dude, there's a stash box in here. Store all junk. Yeah, that lost me about seven pounds. I'm storing these grenades. I never use them. Why not break them down, then? You can't. Hmm, that's interesting. Yeah, I thought it was weird you can't break down grenades. Oh, well, right. I, I well, tried earlier, and I didn't see a way to it, so I don't want to definitively say that you are unable to do it, but I was unable to do it. I say we head I'm to the... I'm following you, Sugar Plum. I'm headed to the west. Uh, so I'm trying to find explain a the radioactive stuff being needed in uh, sites further for me. Like, what purpose does it serve IRL? That's um, uh, so you can see it at night. It puts off a very mild glow, so you don't see it, really notice it during the day, but at night it looks like it glows faintly. Same thing they put in, like, watches to, like, get the glow face on the watch. Oh, Okay. That's very interesting. I didn't know. But see, I'm, I'm the kind of person that it's like, I think that's kind of dumb. And then someone would be like, well, it's not dumb because of this. And I'm like, well, that makes sense. I rescind my previous comment. I got no problem eating crow. <laughs> Come on, what am I hung up on? What am I hung up on? A rock, a branch, a tree, and orangutan. I think it was where, like, the boundaries <laughs> of, like, the side of a tree met the side of a rock a and image. also met the side of an orangutan. <laughs> I got a mental image of you tripping over a poor orangutan carcass. <laughs> and it's, it's the funniest thing I've ever Scorched thought. Scorched Wanderer over here. I'm going to engage. I want the XP. Uh, there's something over here called Mr. Fluffy. It's a robot. I'm going to talk to him. Hello, Mr. Fluffy. The Scorched Wanderer had a sickle. All right, you know what? This Grafton Mayor, his radio station sucks. Audi. I Audi. Ow, I punched my desk. That's just how hard you roll, Mitchell. It's true. Hey, Mr. Fluffy. Just so odd to see humans again. Well, the non-rotten kind, anyway. Uh, apparently you have to pick up this camping syllabus from this tent. Find a safe spot. Be sure to look for fresh animal or human droppings nearby. Remember, if you find doo-doo, better shoo-shoo. Use recycled materials construction <laughs> tent. You can find uh, scraps just about anywhere. Why have a camp? Cook stations. Uh, even your own stash. Assignment. Students should check in with any local responder and build camp. Whatever. Whatever. It's just going to give us some stupid waypoint marker. Yep. It did. <laughs> All right. I think the, I think the high school is right over here. 
Or not the high school, the inoculation Onward. project. See the see the like silos just to the south of us? That's where we're going. We've actually got a lot of markers down there for some reason. Yeah. I don't see any silos, I just see the markers. Well on the map they oh, look not they silos. Are. Um whatever those like long, a factory. Like hangar type structures. Yeah. On the on the world map they were look like that. I just misspoke when I said silos. Gotcha. Yeah, there there are like three or four things right over there. Well, good. Let's go here and mop up. Huh? What is this? An engine block? Just hanging? Oh, so yeah, we're back here. Here's a quest, though. Might as well pick it up. We're back where? Wasn't this the robot? Geek Squad repair place nope, that we we're found? we're in a completely different area. Really? Yep. Well, it looks exactly the same. Gotta love that procedural generation. Yarp. I, actually, I don't think this game is procedurally generated, but still. Uh, recycling of assets. Yeah. So what do we got here? Camp Guide will play. Uh, apparently Does that count I'm as first. me taking it when I hit play? I think so. Apparently, I have to drink three whole things of purified water. Can you imagine? Like, I don't know. Is that... That's not how I work. Like, yeah, oh, I'm thirsty. Either. I'm going to chug three bottles of water. Don't get me wrong. I statistically am drinking something at all times. So much so, you've worried about my prostate. <laughs> so what are we doing at the terminal here? The Checking schematics. So... Downloaded schematics. So we're on tentative plan is right here. Yeah. And then we are apparently supposed to give a holotape to Miguel's Protectron. And, and that's back at his yeah. camp, probably, right? Yeah. Tasks. Get Gary a gift for his next visit. Who's Gary? Give holotape to where? Where is the holotape? Did we? Not I guess it's the thing we. Up? I guess it's the one we picked up right here. Um, this is also final departure. Learn about the inoculation project is also in this town. So that Let's is do it. just to the east of us. I'm with you, sugar plum. So let me turn east. Yep, twenty four. Whatever the unit of measure is, this way. I'm a good follower. I'm following. Cool. You just like looking at my tuchus. Are you sure this isn't mm. the same place? Mm. Because I ran across this exact same corpse in this exact same wheelchair in this exact same position. Oh, you know you what? Positive? You're right. You're right. I so it is the, the same wrong. place? Same place. You were right. I was wrong. Okay. Hey, I was willing to believe... What the hell is this? Oh, it wants us to... How do we get in there? Uh, oh, this way. This way. Go around. Go around. Go around! I was willing to believe that it looked exactly the same. Inoculation... Something or other. Also, I just got a checkpoint. And an achievement. Study Dr. Hudson's research. Scorch beasts? What is a scorch beast? The name kind of terrifying scorch. images. We first learned about them from the Brotherhood of Steel, whose soldiers encountered the creatures to the southeast. Black you know what's interesting? Wings against a Listen, blood red sunset. Listen to me. You know what's interesting? I always listen to you. Whenever I'm standing behind you, if I click on Use Terminal, the one you're on, I bring up my Pip-Boy, and I'm accessing the exact same thing on my Pip-Boy. Mm-hmm. I wonder how many people can do that. I don't know. Fight the Scorched as you would a raider. No shit. 
give holotape to Miguel's protection to Dr. Grafton Mayor, Vault Tech University. So study Dr. Hudson's research is where we're at now, right? Yeah, and I clicked on everything in the computer. An ounce of prevention. I like that little animation that plays. That's pretty cool. Unless Girl, it, okay, I got I some say, sunglasses. I've been wearing sunglasses. Am I not wearing them? Do they look cool? Mm, you are not wearing sunglasses. I must have taken them off at some point accidentally. Uh, I also got a gun called a Somerset Special. Now. Wait, which is cooler, Mitchell? These? Those are cool. Or these? Mm, first ones. Thanks, babe. Mm-hmm. All right, so is Dr. Hudson's research anywhere close? No clue. I'll tell you what. You call the episode, I'm going to look at the map. But look at my hat. I'm Hold on. beautiful. So sassy fine. Whoop, whoop. Just the sound of the police. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> Just the sound of the beast. I'm going to twerk while you do that. Whoop, whoop. Mm. Girl, check it. Oh, man. I look, That's where it's at. I look like I belong in the YMCA. Yep. It's fun to say it the YMCA. It's fun dun, to dun, say dun, it dun, the dun, YMCA. Dun. All right, then. So what are we going to do next time? Uh, I think head back up Psych, to Dr. Miguel's to research. next time to find out. Ha ha. I got you both. I got you both oh, good. You almost tricked me into revealing it, Mitchell. Call it. Dude, you're, do you're doing the stanky leg. As always, thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Enjoy your stinky leg.